Hello guys, and in today's video I'm just going to be answering some of the questions you had for me based on the latest update Android Marshmallow for the G4. Uh, first of all, um, you guys wanted to find out how to format your SD card. I mean, it's in the settings but you have to dig deep as I mentioned on um, some of the LG G4 forums. So let's get started. I'm going to show you guys how to format your SD card. So if we go on to settings and then go into general scroll down and go into storage once we're on the storage it doesn't look like the SD card has any options but when you click on it it's got additional settings and once you go on that you, uh, on the far right hand side of the screen you've got three dots and this allows you to select some options so once you go onto that, you go onto settings, and then here you've got how much you've used. You can either eject the um, SD card or format it. I'm not going to press format because I don't want to format my SD card. Uh, and regards to the latest software update, um, some of you guys are not getting over the air updates yet. So what I done was I manually updated the software using LG's AirDrive service. Um, I'll show you where you need to go to download it uh, through the com uh, through this smartphone. So if you just go into Google, go into LG Air Drive Download, and then we go on to the first link which says LG Bridge. And then when we scroll further down, it's a bit hard to find. Um, right over here it says to download LG Bridge to your Windows PC, click here then it basically downloads it to your computer it, you can't download it on your smartphone by the way so make sure that you do it for a computer and once you connect your LG G4 um, to your computer the software you know will recognize the device but first you do need an LG account in order to do so and then once you're connected it basically checks um, you know the software updates that are available and I'm pretty sure every single one of you should be able to manually update it on the G4. It's just like an early and quicker way to receive the updates because it hasn't gone, um, you know, worldwide yet. LG is still testing the software even though it's probably the final version. That's about it, guys. So if you've got any more questions, please do um, comment down on the section below or you know, comment on some of the LGG4 forums I've posted. And thank you for watching, guys.